Well, you see them on the streets with their thundering motorcycles, but it's not exactly like TV's Sons of Anarchy. No, these are good people. And this Saturday marks the 8th annual Ride for the GI. It's a fundraising effort for our veterans. And Chip is live in Humble this morning. Help us get a handle on what it takes to throttle up a giant ride like this. Chipper! And it, and it really does become a giant ride. So I've got Cass joining me, who's the president and one of the founders of Outcasts MC, or Motorcycle Club. And Cass, I gotta tell you, before we did our little shoot the other day, I had never been on a true group ride. So we have some video of that in action, just so people can kind of get a taste of what it's like to be out on the road with a bunch of motorcycles. That said, Saturday's the big event. What all is it about, and, and kind of how does it work for anyone else that's never been a part of it? Uh, this Saturday, the 17th at 7 a.m., we're going to start setting up for the fun run. Fun run and uh, leave from here at Time Out Tavern in Humble and take a long ride out towards uh, the countryside across the lake to Dayton, back around, one stop in the middle. Cool. Takes about two hours. Uh, and then you come back here and uh, join the festivities. Uh, we'll have uh, a chop competition with all the local guys. You know, nice. Coming in. Uh, nobody knows the ingredients, so it's, it's a big surprise. Uh, we have live auctions, silent auctions, all kind of 50-50 uh, raffles, anything to help raise money for awareness for PTSD Foundation of America and cool. Camp Hope in Houston. And that's the fundraising side of it. And so me as a motorcyclist and as a staff sergeant in the Army Reserve, obviously this is my kind of event. What's neat though is you, don't, you do not have to be a motorcycle rider or even a passenger to take part. That's the ride side, but the event itself, as you mentioned, kicking off 9 a.m. registration, 11 a.m. ride starts. You get to kind of dip into all those things. Now, really quickly, tell me about Outcasts MC because this is a relatively young club. And as Owen said, nothing Nothing like Sons of Anarchy. No, not, not even close. Uh, we, we were founded uh, with a group of guys in 2007. Officially on paper, 2009, we became a 501c3 cool. um, nonprofit, and we raise money for not, not just the troops, but for the community in general. You know, we'll have uh, all different types of of uh, events like you know pediatric brain yeah. cancer. I mean, anything you could think of, we're out to help. Nice. Community. Well, if you guys are interested, obviously the event this Saturday, otherwise the club is something that any motorcyclist can join, or maybe they're just a fan of them. So I wanted to give you guys a little taste of just what that ride looks like when it starts. We've got a couple dozen bikes out here, but imagine this with like 50 to Turn them up. That's just a little taste. Oh it's gonna be a lot bigger, Very a lot cool. louder. Oh yeah. Weekend, right? You can hear them coming. <laughs> I would love to have that there? mass camera when the whole thing kicks off. Yeah. Can you imagine that sea of better, riders? a drone following them down. Oh, uh, Owen's volunteering. Yeah. Your weekend plans yeah, know, lined right? up yeah. now. Uh, that would be cool. Like I got one Saturday morning. Hey, great support too out there. We want to show you guys oh though, how they got some of those pictures yesterday uh, on the ride. Caesar, well done. Yes. Yep, yep, back of a trike. Look at that. Ah, Caesar Martinez. Three Wooler. Awesome job. Yep. Oh Those my three wheels are pretty cool.